Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Back in April 2017, IAI and India signed 1.6 billion dollar contract for the MRSAM system for India's ground forces. The development involves several Indian companies such as Bharat Electronics Limited, Larsen and Tubro and Bharat Dynamics Limited as well as Israel's Rafale Advanced Defense System. On December 23, 2020, Indian Army successfully tested its new surface-to-air missile MRSAM. The test was considered very essential for India's air defense system. Now today, MRSAM is going to be formally inducted into Indian Air Force in the presence of Defense Minister Shri Rajnath Singh. In this video, we will discuss all the capabilities of MRSAM being used by Indian Tri Services and its future developments. So let's get started. Now, before discussing about MR SAM, let's try to understand why Indian Army needs MR SAM. We all are very much aware of the importance of air defense system in the present time. It's very essential for any nation to have better air defense system, as seen in the conflict between Israel and Hamas. Currently, Indian Army uses very old defense systems purchased in 80s and are outdated considering the present technological advancements. Currently, Indian Army uses two advanced air defense systems that are Akash and QRSAM, which is under trials. MRSAM is going to be the third advanced air defense system of the Indian Army. Talking about MRSAM, it is a medium range surface to air missile. MRSAM is jointly developed by Israel's aerospace industry, Rafale, and DRDO, whereas Bharat Dynamics Limited produces the missiles. MRSAM is going to be the land based version of Barak 8 missiles. Currently, Indian Army uses very old defense systems purchased in 80s and are outdated considering the present technological advancements. At present, Indian Army uses two advanced air defense systems that are Akash and QRSAM, which is under trials. MRSAM is going to be the third advanced air defense system of Indian Army. Talking about MRSAM, it's a medium range surface to air missile. It is jointly developed by Israeli Aerospace, Rafale and DRDO, whereas Bharat Dynamics Limited produces the missile. MRSAM is a land-based version of Barak 8 missiles. You will be surprised to know that Barak 8 is an advanced variant of Barak 1 missile which is already in service with Indian Navy since 2001. Indian Navy uses this missile as point air defense system to counter Pakistan missiles. But due to its shorter range of 12 kilometers, India and Israel decided to extend the range of the missile and Barak 8 is the result of that initiative. Barak 8 missiles have a range of 70 kilometers and it is being used in Indian Navy's latest Kolkata class destroyers. MRSAM is a land-based version of Indian Navy's Barak 8 missiles which can be used to defend against helicopters, ballistic missiles, anti-ship missiles, fighter jets, cruise missiles and UAVs. MRSAM is designed for Indian Army and Air Force. It consists of three important parts. The first part is command and control center responsible for processing the field data and orders the firing command. Second part is multifunctional radar responsible for tracking and detecting the threats. It uses phased array radar for tracking. Third part is missile launcher. MRSAM can provide 150 km area coverage for any aerial threat. As soon as radar detects the threat, it passes on the location of the threat to command and control center. After processing the data, command and control station orders for firing the missile. Each and every MRSAM missile is controlled by two-way data link for relaying mid-course guidance and target information to the missile. Talking about its dimension, it has length of 4.5 meter, weight around 275 kgs and can carry 60 kg of pre-fragmented explosive warhead. The speed of this missile is Mach 2. It consists of advanced RF seeker for target acquisition and is equipped with canards and fins for control and maneuverability. The missile has electronic countermeasure system to avoid jamming. Each launcher of MRSAM has 8 Barak missiles mounted on high mobility truck. One can fire one or more missile on single target. The Ministry of Defense is procuring an undisclosed number of MRSAM air defense systems to replace Indian Army's aging air defense system. However, 
it is estimated that India will require 1000 units of MRSAM because same number of MRSAM kits were delivered to BDL this year. In future, MRSAM will advance and its range will also be increased to 150 km. This new missile will be known as LRSAM that is Long Range Surface to Air Missile. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.